Hey, welcome back to Tortoise Valley. Uh, we have been in the process of trying to get up a little growing in, or a little um, tailoring industry based around the growing skills of Hawk Lady and Good Guy and the sewing skills of Sending Bat. So that's what we've been working on lately. Also been working a bit on our defenses and I've been trying to get this uh, better sorted out. Now I made a big kind of mistake last time and I'm going to try to fix it this time. It's going to be actually no, I don't want to actually do that. Cancel. What I want to do is put a door right there because these are going to be bedrooms, more bedrooms like these eventually, but I needed to run a power conduit across here and I forgot. So that is something we'll get on as well. But mainly what I want to do today, I think, is get our defenses improved, or at least lay out plans for improved defenses. And Mermu. We're buffed by hungry and feeling terrible. And actually, Lonely, Lonely Orc, how are you doing with that go juice addiction? It's still only 38%. you got a ways to go, so we're just going to... I'm actually going to... Um, oh, actually, that was kind of silly of me. I never did get you guys, you know, the regular work schedule, but I'm actually going to give you joy time all day long, Lonely, because although you're doing good work for us, I want to make sure you've got as much joy as you can to kind of counteract the effects of that withdrawal, help you through your efforts there. Now, okay, Seth put that in. Very good. Now we can go ahead and um, lay some conduits. So I don't know what the grid is like. All right, it's actually up there. So we can just go down like that. So Lonely is in a daze. I guess just the last straw from the Goaduce Addiction. Sorry about that, but hopefully we'll get that sorted out soon. We do need to get this room better sorted out too. Uh, power also needs to be sorted out in here. So stuff, yeah. <laughs> stuff is going slowly. Slowly, slowly. But Seth, okay, you're back to mining. Actually... That's good, but I want you to mine this first. So let's cancel these. We'll come and do them later. Get that mined out first so we can get the storage set up in here. We also want to make sure our roof area is um, going over top. Yeah, all the way to here. All right. Rainy thunderstorm. Not too worried. The rain will probably put out the fires. Our food, you know, we're keeping up, but not fantastically well. One thing is, I don't know how much uh, fish is 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 butchering these guys. Um, it's staying nice and cool in here. Also, probably we need to be cooking some more food. So, we've got... A lot of our growing now is concentrated up here in the money-making business, which is not a bad thing, but... Um, the rain's going to take care of that. But I think more, you know, food down here would not go amiss either. So let's just put in two more growing zones. And make this one corn. And this one... Whoa, hold it. Not all of them. And this one be... Some rice, that's just, you know, that's fast growing stuff, keeping us fed, keeping us from starving. It's nighttime, so people go ahead and sleep. Okay, middle of the night, we have got ourselves a raid. It says, a group of pirates from the skunks of anguish have arrived nearby. They're attacking immediately. What? Do we have here? Wow, we have got one, two, three, four, five. All people, all of whom are have melee weapons. So here's what I'm going to want to do, actually, I think, for that. Besides turn it on that power. Um, so Lonely's not equipped with anything. Uh, let's actually have Lonely come and get the Molotovs. And everybody else, hold it. Oh, come on. All right. You're all drafted. No lonely. Yeah, like I said, come. Well, let's see. Let me look at you. OK, 
okay, your melee is not amazing or anything, so you might as well come as well. Might as well come and I think get the Molotovs. And I'm going to do this a little bit different, though. Actually, hold it. You're moving a little slow. Uh, you're a slow walker and. Sending about you come flick this switch. That's a priority. I never get lights in here. Dang it anyway and everybody and, and everybody else who's drafted For right now Just I'll come to right there. I'm gonna organize you here in a minute Probably before they get here. They're moving fast, but you got to get that that thing switched. Okay, good now what I want is people with guns in the back so, um, that's you, you, and you, and then fish, you have, you're going to be, I think, about there, a little further back from everybody else. And then, it, uh, actually, let's do it this way. Fish to there. I just don't want to get shot by that thing. Uh, sending about... You come to... Uh, I just don't want crossfire from that. Alright, fine. Bjorn to there. Good guy to there. Fish to there. And Hawk Lady to there. And then Mermu to there. Seth to there. And Lonely Orc, you come, I think, to there. So cover does not matter. So what I want is, oh no, ho sorry, Hawk Lady to there and sending back to where Hawk Lady was. So what I want is all of my people with uh, either explosives. Oh, lonely, you didn't get anything. Oh crap. Okay, fine. Come and find that minigun. It's gonna be too late by the time you get there anyway. Dang it. F get the incendiary launcher, I guess. Oh, still going fast. Oops. And then, um, so they won't hit them. And then people in front, I want them to have, like, explosives and stuff like that. Yeah, there's a fire in there, I know. All right. Oh, shoot. Oops. Killed her own or turret. That was going to be a risk. Wow. He was moving fast. Now, these guys are slower. They're going to come in there, of course. Okay, Hawk Lady's been hurt. She's got hit by the minigun. Which is unfortunate. Uh, wait, do... No, Hawk and Seth is hurt from a minigun. So, somebody with a minigun is still hitting people behind. It's unfortunate. All right, well, another explosion. Okay, they're running. A Jade Shiv, a Marble Club, nothing I'm really keen on trying to get. So let's undraft everybody. I'm not gonna chase after these guys because they don't have stuff I want. Well, I mean, yeah, I'd like the personal shield for Seth, but um, it's not super important. And let's turn this off. So I'm really sorry, Hawk Lady and Seth, about the, um, uh, you know, about the, the friendly fire there. Now, let's go ahead, um, strip these guys. Unforbid there's stuff we got from them. And, okay. So three of them are dead. We need to definitely get that up. Now what I want to do actually, I want to move this to here. Because as you saw, like having it back here is just a real problem for you know, people getting hit. It's not a good spot for it now with how things are, are going. So I do want, yeah, Hawk Lady and Seth, bo okay, and both of these rooms are very clean. I want you to both get, for right now, get Glitter World Medicine, I guess. We just, we don't have any of the good non-Glitter World stuff. We just can't afford 
to get, have you get infected. That's all there is to it. So that'll get sorted out. People are sleeping, you know. I mean, sending that. You're pretty well rested, and I think you're one of our really good, yeah, healers. So let's see, 45% and 21%. So Cinebat, come and tend to Hawk Lady. Please, and actually Lonely, putting on a shoddy cloth jacket, eh? Uh, what are you up to? You're going to relax socially? I guess I see that. Okay, and now can you tend to Seth too? Okay. Good, good. Now, three minor break risks. Seth, good guy, and Mermu. What, Seth, what's your deal? Uh, we're buffed by Hawk Lady and Disturbed Sleep. Mermu. Buffalo Hawk Lady insulted. Ooh, an ins we haven't had a lot of insults actually. Who? Fish insulted you. That's interesting because we have been uh, very, you know, um, low on the insults. People have gotten along really, really well in our colony, which I've been really happy about. I mean, obviously not perfectly well, but yeah, pretty, pretty good, which is really, really nice. Okay, so what are we going to do here? Um, right now we're gonna come and plan out some no we're gonna get murmur a beer because he's having serious problems in fact seth let's uh have you haul the corpses because it doesn't bother you and let's come over to Bjorn. There's Alpha Beaver Revenge. So let's, I think you can just escape to here. Wait, or did you kill it? Okay, I guess you killed it. All right, that was just fine. Okay, Mermu. You're still getting your beer. All right. Wait, no, you're not? What are you doing? No, I don't, Mermu. You, you don't like seeing dead people. So we're having you do other stuff instead so you don't have a, you know, lose it. So let's, uh, need to do this eventually. We'll do it now. Keep talking about it. Put a wall around this so that people who have problems seeing dead people don't get freaked out by it. And then people like Seth, who don't seem to care, they can, can deal with it. Uh, all right, never mind. Okay, also personal shields. Shoddy 55, normal 42. Is there a third one somewhere that got hauled already? Maybe not. So I'd like to get Seth to come and actually equip. Let's have him equip, I think, the better one. But since he is a melee fighter, he's a brawler. I've been wanting to get him, you know, kind of in where he goes. Shoot, I said build a copy when I didn't I, when I wanted to actually reinstall it. Well, that's fine. We'll just reinstall that. Um, these will get hauled eventually. How is our block situation? Pretty good with marble. Let's copy, you know, build some more marble traps as well as we're improving our defenses here. But, uh, Mermu, Mermu, what can I do with you? Yeah, all those rotting corpses you've been looking at. Um, oh, you need, how's your joy, man? Let me check that out. Joy's not great. Probably a good joy boost would help you out, but what are you up to? You're moving the dead alpha beavers. Uh, I think it's one more beer for you. I know you're kind of getting into lush today, but you got to get that sorted out. Um, lots of stuff we could be butchering. 
so that's a thing as well. All right, he's you're down to a minor break risk. I think that's pretty good. Let's see, it's uh, if it's 22 hours, you're gonna wanna go home. You're almost there anyway, you'll be fine. So people are gonna go ahead and sleep and we'll let them and we'll see them again when the morning comes. Okay, the morning has come. People are getting up, getting their breakfast, getting to work. And let's see, until they have their joy, not much is gonna get done. But I do wanna come and chart out how I want the kind of replacement um, stuff to go here. And what I wanna do is, marble will be fine. I want to have, so let's see, someone will st have right here this. Then we'll have someone stand behind it like that all the way up. Oops. I didn't really want that. Um, and then, yeah, so we'll have those and we'll put the, the kind of lid over top of that. And we'll have to mine this stuff out as well. So people can stand there. So we'll keep that as it is. And then I want to do something with over here as well. Figure out the best way to get that set up. But I think first getting these firing stations in is going to be really important. Now, uh, not quite sure. Do we want to have this be out and then like kind of these be a little further back. I'm not sure about that. What I am sure about is that A, there's a heat wave, so I hope we are in a good position here. I think right now this venting out here is just okay. We haven't got this sorted out, but we'd be able to keep it nice and cool in here. This is set to 60. I think we should be able to deal with that just fine. This is gonna warm up. So the one thing we do wanna build actually is a wall right here. Get that sorted. But because it's a heat wave also, let's go and change everyone's schedule. So we'll have them sleep again. Have them get up at five. And then have the, you know, uh, the same schedule otherwise just shifted like that. So everything else is work. Oops. And then, but again, lonely, we'll have you getting joy whenever you want to in the daytime. All right, so there you go. So here in a little bit, when it gets, actually it's right now, you guys should go to bed and I think we'll keep it, yeah, it's staying in the 70s in the middle of the day. I do wanna see how is this handling the heat wave? It's not quite, it's ugh, almost, but not quite. So let's take this down to 14 each. Oops, down, down. All right, hold it. Everyone's sleeping, even though it's 20 hours. So now I'm confused. Oh, it's their joy time. Yeah, they slept during their joy time and then they're gonna get up, go to work. 120, nobody seems, is anyone complaining of hot? No. No one's complaining about hot. So that is a good thing. Also, lonely. How is... We're at 49%. That's not terrible. Bjorn, your buildings. So you must have killed all those alpha beavers by now. So that's really good. Tattered apparel. Is that just Seth? Yeah, that's just his his um, protection. His uh, whatchamafidgets. I forget the name of that thing. This, his personal shield. So... Hopefully it's not making them too sad. Murmu again is a little bit unhappy. He's very joy deprived. Why Murmu? Okay, Murmu, I'm a little worried about you. So you're going to get the joy treatment as well for a little bit. So get joyed up and then we'll get back to, to things. All right, Fish has finally caught up on the meals and is now doing the butchering. I like that. So now in the 20s, 26. So putting this at, yeah, putting this at... Uh, 14 seems to be really, really successful here. 
These are in the 80s, which is uncomfortable, you know, in real life, but it's probably fine. And good. Now, Seth is eaten out here. He's going to complain about that probably. And he's mining. So why is... Who's major? Seth is major now. Okay. Very tired. That's true. You guys sort of didn't get a proper sleep because of the way that timed out. So I want you, I really want you minding that. It's an important thing. But let's uh, have one on me before you start the mining. All right, there we go. Yeah, much better. Yeah, you'll mine that out or a little bit of it and you go rest because it's sleeping time. All right. So it's, uh, oh good, those survival rifles are done. But it is, is sleep in the, in the daytime time. So let's let people do that and we'll get back to uh, them when they wake up. Okay, people are starting to wake up, which is good. But one thing that's not good is cloth is not getting stored. And that is not a good thing. We are going to do, actually, I am going to have Hawk Lady make a whole bunch of cloth cowboy hats, I think. Just for selling purposes. And that will help us also make more room for cloth. And a Hawk Lady, sing me about. Yeah, that'll keep her nice and busy making those cowboy hats. Now... I think we should have enough dusters for everyone, but Lonely doesn't have one. So maybe we didn't make quite enough with that bill. So let's uh, set that as well. And we'll prioritize that. We want all of our people to get dusters. And yeah, and also now Lonely here, we can have come and equip. Ooh, it's a good survival rifle. Very nice. That one's good as well. Nice work, Sending Bat. And fish, yeah, you as well, because you hit some of your friends there. So we get much better, um, you know, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Accuracy with those survival rifles. And, I mean, they're not, I think the best probably would be like maybe either an SMG or another um, charge rifle. But, but the survival rifles are a nice blend of distance and accuracy and so i'm just gonna, I'm going for them they're a quick easy easy make uh and i like them so okay this now is okay good spectacular we can move all of these things out now we do want to come back in and mine these out again so seth you can work on that i noticed this was not getting done and the reason it wasn't getting done is because we don't have enough of the um, marble. We're all out of marble blocks at this point, or almost out. Basically, yeah, we're all out. So we'll just do slates instead. So slate blocks, there we go. Same pattern like that. And once we have that, we can start chopping this down. This is room for one, two, three, four, five shooters. So we'll have to think, do we want room for more shooters over to the side as well? Not really sure. An exotic goods trader has just come by. So let's take, we said Mermu was our guy for this. So actually Mermu, you come see if we got anything they want. Not name category there we go okay i don't want to sell them our beer we like our beer uh i guess yeah i will we'll sell them that so this one yeah 90 that's pretty good Could, just looking around i mean we're not getting hardly any money for these they're actually let's let's uh it's 22 percent and it's shoddy we'll get rid of that all this low percentage stuff we get rid of. Um, but now we come up here and look. I wouldn't mind getting another, say, five neuteroamine. That's going to lock us down. Sell the Yayo. We don't have... Oh, we have an AI Persona Core. And we can get a ton of money for that. If we're going to get out of here, we'll have to buy, you know, get one eventually. 
but there'll probably be more psychic ships before that happens. So that seems to me like a really smart move to go ahead and sell that. I'm just thinking. The one thing it does do is make us rich and thus make us a tempting target for bad guys. But we're trying to get money. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. They're selling that to us. Ours is not here for sale. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right. Let's do this. Little bit of micromanaging right here. Who's close and can haul? Let's see. Actually, let's... let's uh, this is going to be a little weird, but... We create a stockpile. We're going to... No, hold it. Wait, did I just make this... Oh, it made a stockpile hit exactly. Okay, that was weird. So copy the settings... Delete the stockpile. Dang it. Make a stockpile right here. Make another little one right there inside the area. Uh, make this just only for AI persona cores, which should be in here somewhere. Items, maybe? Yep. And make this critical. And then get someone who's nearby, which is nobody is nearby. Bjorn is nearby to come and... I can't haul it. Pete's sake. All right, fine. Now we'll make this not take Persona cores. Now can Bjorn haul it? Yeah. Okay. And now where's Mermu? He's right here. You come back. How much will you give us for our Persona core? All right, we're taking that. Now, with that in mind, any more neuteroamine or, or uh, components that we want? Those would be the things to buy, I think. I don't think we need plasteel right now. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, but I don't want to buy it. Bionic Eye, eh, it would be a kind of a straight up trade. I don't think we have a real need for it right now. So let's just, they have the money. Let's just take the money and run at this point. Oh, wait, they don't... What? What? Hold it. There we go. All right, I did, I did the wrong way, didn't I? All right, I went like that. Yeah, like that. All right, now we're, take, now we're taking the money and run. Running. All right, good, good, good. Now people can go to sleep. The money will just sit there. The new. Okay, let's go ahead and undo what I just did. Delete that. Let AI cores go back in here again. We're going to fix this all eventually anyway. This is not how it should be. Now, people are going to sleep. When I, they wake up in the morning, I'll put them back on the regular schedule, if you know what I mean. But while they're sleeping, real quick. Now, this is all cut out. What I want to do is get this set up. So, we're going to have a stockpile area right in here and this is going to be for uh it'll be preferred and it will be for textiles all of them except for cloth and then we'll set this ah come on to be uh just for cloth and we'll we'll make it grow we'll grow it out till it f is just like that i think and then can we put another one that touches without merging no not like that we can't so let's try it like this dang it all right all right it's not gonna work so what we're going to do then is, uh, yeah, put a stockpile zone in here. Paste the settings. Is that what I want? Yeah, that's what I wanted. And then make another stockpile zone, and we'll just put it right down there. And this is going to be for uh, preferred clear art for clothes, apparel. There, apparel. 
but the qua- the has to be fifty percent or better. And some are what want to make a stockpile for our dumpy clothes too. But for right now, just the good stuff goes in there. And yeah, so those hats should get moved. All right, Lonely's got a duster now. Mermu does not, but maybe he doesn't want one. I'm not really sure what's going on with that. Uh, that's getting sorted out. This, I... What? There we go. Should make it slate instead. I'm not sure what our slate is. Oh, we've got some cargo pods. Kibble. That's great. We'll feed it to our elephant uh, by putting a little... Oh, lonely. Poor lonely. By putting a little kibble stockpile in right about here. Okay. Uh, so that's our, great. We're going to go ahead and put everybody back now. They can go to bed now. It's the middle of the night. Get some more sleep and wake up in the morning. Put them back on their normal sleep schedule, which has them... Waking up at five for three hours of joy. Uh, working for, oops, working, I said. For a bunch of time, going to bed at 10. So we'll put them on that. Paste it all along here. And we will uh, let people, they're gonna head off to bed now. We're still, this is, okay, this is getting closer to done. We're still going to work on it more, but we are getting stuff accomplished. We're starting to get a base. We're getting a little industry here. We've got a place where once our haulers start hauling, we're going to have all of this cloth be stored. All our textiles move to there. Looking pretty good, people. Looking pretty good. So that's going to be it for today. Come back here when the sun rises, but thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon.